Slack Attack. Well, yeah, thanks for joining me again. Welcome back to the Major Slack Attack, your first offer titillating tactical Tamriel gameplay. And my name is Major Slack, I'm your host, and this is a series of videos I'm going to call Back in Business. Back in Business. This will help me make the transition from my no purchase challenge run to playing Skyrim using money again. I can hear some of you saying yeah and for those of you who don't know my no purchase challenge run is a special challenge I did where I built a dragon ready stealth archer the one you see right here from level 1 all the way up to level 37 okay without using any gold whatsoever no money exchanged hands in this gal's uh, journey through Skyrim okay no uh, earning money and no spending money more importantly no spending money I did not purchase a single thing I maintained a zero gold balance throughout the entire thing. Is it possible to play Skyrim on legendary difficulty without buying or selling? Yes, it is. Definitely. The answer is yes. Check out my um, my playlist and you'll see the no purchase challenge run to see how I came upon um, this character right here. Now I'm going to permit my girl, Leia Lightfoot, to start spending money again. And this series of videos will help me make the transition. Um, I have to admit I'm having some difficulties. I've gotten so used to playing Skyrim without money that buying and selling now feels like a cheat. <laughs> no kidding, it feels like a cheat. Um, like I had to join No Purchase Challenge Runners Anonymous to help me kick the habit. You know, like it feels really weird. You know, I have this overwhelming urge to every once in a while dump all the gold out of my inventory and stop buying and selling as well. So I have to call up my sponsor and he has to talk me through it. You can do it Slack. Come on. You got this. You got this. One day at a time kind of thing. You know. So yeah. 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 All kidding aside. We, we are back in business. I'm going to start off by power leveling speech to get um, the merchant prick. That's, that's the thing that makes the most sense to do right now. Get the merchant prick so we can sell anything to anybody because I do have a lot of things to sell. Let's start this off by getting the Haggling one perk, all right? Now, um, I originally planned to do this a little later, but I want to go over to Windhelm right now because there is a bug with Sadri, and I want to make sure this is not in effect. There's this little run you have to do with Viola. He gets caught with a stolen ring in his inventory, and um, what time is it? Business hours? Business hours? And he asks you to do a favor for him and return that ring to Viola's um, apartment, home, if you will. Sometimes the dialogue to start that quest off does not appear in Sadri's list of options. I've seen this Take happen occasionally and I have no idea I'm how sure to get out of it, so I just want to make sure before. it is available. All there it is. Goods are legitimate. Which is more than I can say for some. Nothing in here is stolen, nothing at all. Sometimes this doesn't appear, and it's really exasperating because they could just screw everything up. Sadri, uh, there's no way to get him to offer you speech skill training, and this is important to power level speech. Let's kick this of off right now. Nothing in here is stolen, only a careless, shameful, idiotic. Yeah, 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 you got a ring, right? Azura, I've made a terrible mistake. You want us to return it? I bought a gold ring. It's not that easy. She'd go to the Jarl if she knew I was even remotely involved. You have to get it to her some other way. Can do, no problem. Look, it's dangerous. But if you sneak the ring into her house, Can do. put it in a dresser or something. Yeah, we're on it. I will make it worth your while. We got it. Okay, let's go. We got our sneak on. Let's just do this right now and complete it so that we get uh, speech skill training available with Sadri. You've all seen this before. We just run across town, go into Viola's house. I meant to make a lock picking potion. Hold it there. Keep your keep your distance. Okay. There's no way out of that. Not doing that. Don't need to. Okay, here we go. Quick save. This is a master lock. This could take a moment or two, so smoke him if you got him. Here we go. Booyah! 
Level me up. Thank you very much. Sneaky, sneaky. Into the dresser it goes. Out we go. Now let's cut back to Sadri's. If not, let me know. I might have it stored away. Have you taken care of that little problem? Yes, we took care of your <coughs> problem and placed Viola's ring in her house. Thank you, thank you. Azura's prophecy always guides you to fortune. That's okay, now give me the mula. Fortune. Here, everything I earned from my last shipment, it's yours. A thousand bucks, wow, awesome. Okay, great, and now he'll offer a speech skill training. Great, so that is in the bag. Now, let me get back to my regular routine. I got a whole to-do list here. Let me just save the save the game. So I just wasted 30 minutes um, doing a whole bunch of other stuff first. And by the time I got to Sadri's, it was bugged out. And it wouldn't offer me the option to, the, to do that whole Viola thing. And I, I was screwed. There was nothing I could do. I had to start over again. So here we go. Back to my list. Number one on the list, get haggling. Did I do that? Yes, I did. Number two on the list, get the thief book at the DBHQ. Here we are at the Dark Brother headquarters. What did I say? Dark Brother headquarters? Dark Brotherhood headquarters. Alright, sneak book. Is in Babette's room. Babette's room is here. Go up here. That's her little bed. Oh, there's the sneak book. And we can take it. That's okay. Sell that. Next. Get power potions. In the course of building my no purchase challenge run stealth archer, um, I had occasion to make a whole bunch of power potions to level up alchemy. But I couldn't sell them. Now we can finally sell them. So out they come. That'll do for now. Next. I want to get some cer certain ingredients. I got a whole list here. Blue butterfly wing, 35. Blue mountain flower, 35. Dragon's tongue, 37. LZ or 24, I think that's all I got. Juniper berries to go along with the LZ to make some fortified marksman potions. 24. Namira's rot to make some fortified locksmith potions, which I don't really need anymore. I'm not going to make them anyways. Uh, let's make, say, two. And you make that by mixing it with pine thresh eggs. Take a couple of those. Snowberries, 37. Close enough for rock and roll. And Thistle, 37. And finally, Wheat. Take all of them. That's that. Let me just clean out the inventory. I'll skip ahead. That works for me. Let's go make a lock picking potion. Mixers, hat, gloves, necklace, and ring all on. Get away from the table there. My table. My table. My, 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 my. The mirror is rot. That's all we're going to make for now. Mirror, mirror is rot. Pine thrush shakes. There we go. Lock picking is 28% easier. Thank you very much. Better gear up, Lear. You're bound to run into some vampires. My spidey sense is so tingling. There we go. Let's go wheat farming. Eventually I want to make some power potions. Blue butterfly's wing. Blue butterfly wing. 
uh, blue mountain flower and wheat. And I pulled up the wrong screen. I wanted to pull up the map. Here we go. Let's go swinging across to these farms, stringing out to the northeast from Windhelm Stables. Let's start with this guy here. Because the brandy mug farm I already got the wheat from that farm. And it hasn't respawned yet. There you go. Let's make this quick and painless. Grab a couple of eggs. And we're good. This guy's is right over here. <laughs> Speed loading here, boss. Mrs. Spot. Yeah, I know, Mrs. Spot. Gotcha. And how about some snowberries? Yum, 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 yum. That's good. We're good. Next, let's go to Riften. Riften Stables. Pick up the Amulet of Zenithar. You know I already have one, but you may not have one, so uh, let me just go through the routine so that everybody's on the same page. Um, wait till morning. Also, we can have to hit up a shrine of Zenithar that's right nearby. And I knew it. I freaking knew it. Let me see if I could draw these vampires away from the guards. Hey, that my horse pretty good. Actually, let's see if I could draw them into the, the frostbite spiders and the, and the wolf. Oh, they're not going to bite. Okay. Shields up there. Alright, he's down. What, you want to go pick a fight with the vampires there, Frost? We don't have to, you know. Oh, it's the frostbite spider. Okay. Oh, great. <laughs> the vampires are all engaged with him. Okay, this is kind of tricky. Let me just do a quick save here because I don't want to get a bounty. And let me get my vampire buster on this guy here. Undead up to level 23. Flee for, 20, for 30 seconds. Okay, which one of you wants the wrath of slack? Okay, that's good. Can't hide from me. Where are you? Cleared out, I guess. I can't believe it. You guys actually killed a group of vampires? That's astonishing. I've never seen that before. Usually they're that but but as useless as two tits on a board, let me tell you. Good day. Amazing! Hey, you saw it here first, ladies and gentlemen. The townsfolk actually managed to kill a group of vampires. Mind you, they were guards, but still. Sometimes when you see, like, you know. A dozen townsfolk all going after, like, one master vampire, and they're making no headway whatsoever. It's, it's really pathetic. You've seen it, eh? Okay, this is where we're going right here. This is what I call the Broken Tower of Zenithar. It's always a predator here. I can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this predator. Get the right bow on. What? That's it? Okay, here we go. Come on. You and me. Mano a barrel. Is that the best you could do? Come on, take another shot. I tell you, you're going to lose this fight. <laughs> I love the way she does that. It's like Shazam! <laughs> okay, did I get Bone Break Fever? No, I did not. Alright, now. Amulet of Xanathar. Some gold. I finally have money. <laughs> and the Shrine of Xanathar. We're good. Next on the list, Windhelm and rent a room.
And put away your bow there. You're going to town. Put on your Sunday best. Including that nice little amulet of Zenithar. That guy, gloves, hat, uh, ring, and how about the smithing smock? There we go. Looking pretty smithy. Put away... Oops. Yeah, put away your bow. There we go. Pretty spiffy. Okay, let's go rent a room. <laughs> For the first time in 37 levels. Got some fresh... Sure thing. I know I haven't been here in a while, but... Uh, Right this way. Let me know if there's anything else you need. And let's wait till morning time. Or business hours to be more exact. Excellent. Let's go get a little nest egg of gold happening by selling some potions in town here. And then we'll hit up Sadri's and start power leveling speech. Okay, everybody at your posts. Thank you very much. Nirinye, you're first up to bat. Who wants to do if you're looking to take a look? I've got some po fine poisons of damage magic or regen. Let's sell them to her one at a time. Something's wrong here. I did not get the Thank thief you. stone activated. Okay. I'll do this off camera. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I could tell right away that I didn't have the thief stone because I always level up speech Industry selling those purchase. first three potions to Nurni well and it didn't happen. Come see me. Okay, I'm so what do you got for sale? Da, 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 da. She won't be needing them you, I've got some nice poisons of damage, uh, damage magic or regen to sell you. Once again, one at a time to help level up speech. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And that's all the money you got. Be sure to stop Let's go inside. Sadri's used wares. What a coincidence. That's where we're going next. Irelian. Take a look. Same deal here. Uh, these guys. One at a time. Hope to see you again soon. Okay, so this just should give us a nice little nest egg of so 1900 bucks about... Oh, even more. Great, okay. To the answer. Now, we are certainly eligible to buy skill training because we haven't bought any for this character at all. So, there's no problem there. Let me just double check all my active effects here. Thief stone well rested, that's correct. Amulet Zenithar, Shrine of Zenithar. That's correct. Everything's good. Let me know if you see anything you like. Okay, here we go. Quick save. Good to see. I would you. like some training Finally. in speech. Well, you've come to the right place. Five times, please. My goods are legitimate, which is more than I can say for some. I like to share my good trader dropped by recently. All right. Take a look. Now you got a whole bunch of money. Let's get it back. Excellent. Okay, now we're going to have to level up again, again to get the right to buy some more skill training. So, now, this hey, is companion. where all those ingredients that we took come into play. We're going to power level alchemy and get ourselves up to level 38 so we can get ourselves a perk point. And gain the right to buy some more speech skill training. Thank you again for the men's Cookware, knives, and other 
got something for just about everybody in here. All right. Once again, active effects, thief stone well rested. That's all we need. Quick save before any major crafting session. And ingredients: blue butterfly wing, blue mountain flower, and wheat. Yeah, cranking them out here, boss. Come on, come on, come on! Add a boy. He's good level upper. All right, that's right. That's and we got some more potions to sell. Do. Hang on, wait. Let's do my little drum roll. You done? Okay. <laughs> let's level up. Health. And naturally, let's put a point to Allure. Get better prices with Sadri, because our girl is the opposite sex. Let's swing on back to Sadri and buy some more speed skill training. Uh oh. Slack is destroying the game again. Send in the authorities. Got something for just about everybody in here. Give Back at Sadri's. Any questions. All my goods are well, you've come to the right place. Speech skill training times five, please. Now with the potions that we're going to sell back to him. I like to share my good fortune. They should bring speech up to 45, maybe even 46. Trader dropped by. Take a look. There we go. That's it, that's all the money he's got. Do come again. Speech up to 45, that's great. Now, there's four skill books, speech skill books that we can collect. There's actually five, but we already collected one earlier on. But I know how to fix that. And we can use them to get up to 50. First one's here, right behind Sadri. The buying game is the one I already picked up. Um, tell you what, let's do this little run here in Windhelm to level up Sneak. While we're here, go out to the Windhelm docks. Huh. This guy's kind of hard to, um, just thought of something. It's this Argonian called Stands in Shallows. If you get this special double distilled skooma for him from the nicest corner club, he'll level up sneak for you. Now, since he's so hard to uh, contact, I was wondering if you could just go get that skooma in advance. Will it spawn? And while we're here, there's this sneak skill book here as well. Right underneath the stairs here. Right there. Just read that up. Little little sneak. Up on the second floor underneath the stairs on the second floor. Right behind here in between two crates should be... There it is. Double distilled skooma. Alright, save some time here. Get this in advance and then just hand it to him. That's using your noggin. Yeah. Okay, now let's go to the docks. Uh, am I going the right way? No, I'm not. Take it on my feet here, boss. Alright, so I think on your feet. No, no, no. Like Get away from me, kid. Beat it, bro. Please. Beat it, kid. Oh, I... Later, when we're feeling a little more motherly. <laughs> right now, he's about business. Okay, stands in shallows. Can't be found in the Argonian assemblage right here. Um, wait till 8 o'clock. That's when all the Argonians get off work at the docks and then they start filing into their dormitory, the Argonian assemblage. 
is still locked. You have to wait for them to come. He used to hear they come. As soon as one of them goes in, the door will be open. You could lock pick pick the lock to get in, but uh, as soon as you get in, they'll tell you that you can't be there, and you won't be able to do business. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And there we go. Okay, let's find stands and shallows. Is that you? That's it. By the history, Are you alright? No, I'm not. I feel like my scales are clawing into me. Maybe you could help an old Argonian out? Maybe. What do you want? I heard some of the sailors talking about how they stashed a bottle of double distilled skooma in the Nissus. Double drum. distilled skooma. They're taste. good stuff, eh? Okay, I'll get it for you. Thank you. I'll be waiting for that bottle. Hey, how about that? We already got it. There you go. Thank you so much. Here, let me show you a thing or two about not attracting attention to yourself. Any loves of sneak? I would not complain if you returned with some skooma. There you go. Mission accomplished. Sneak up to 80. That worked out right nicely. I think that calls for a Mr. Burns. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Burns. All right, next, White Run. Continue level up speech. Continue leveling up speech. There's a speech skill book in Bellathor's, and we can also do a little favor for Carlotta. Is it business hours? Close enough for rock and roll. No vampire. No vampire. No vampire. No vampire. No vampire. What do you need? Nothing. We're good. Hmm. Looks like somebody was littering. <laughs> I'll just pick that up. Carlotta! Having some problems? Life's hard enough. That bard Mikhail is begging for a dagger up against his throat, the way oh, he yeah? goes on about me. Really? I heard him boasting at the bannered mare, saying he'll conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. <laughs> How about that? Huh. What if we talk to him? If you want to try, go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. Uh, he hasn't met my gal, Leia. Fresh food and vegetables. All right, Leia. Lay some smooth Just talking on this guy. Fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Make sure he gets a good gander at your cleavage. I'm a bard by trade. Perhaps you've heard of me. You need to leave Carlotta Valentia alone. Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? I'm sorry, but that fiery widow is mine. She just doesn't... No, 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 no. She's not yours. Stop it. <sighs> Maybe you're right. There we go. Uh. I guess I just didn't want anyone to think I couldn't handle one Nord lass. Oh, well. It's the leaving uh -huh. that's hardest. It happens. <laughs> All right, now Carlotta should have like 600 beans to pay us. Carlotta. Ripe fruit and fresh veg. Really? You convinced that loot player to stop chasing me? Uh huh. I'd thank the gods, but I'll settle for thanking you. That's right. Here's some coin. Sure Give up the Skrilla. Six hundred. Yeah. There Thanks we go. Thank you business. very much. Next, Bellathor's speech skill book in here. Got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any. Don't steal it. Just read it. Could sell him some potions yeah, too. Why not? Take a look. Do come back. <laughs> Next, Falkreath. Dead man's drink and Falkreath has a speech skill book. Why is everybody running around? Are there vampires here? Let me just quickly get that speech skill book and get out of town. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. Alright, in the local inn behind the counter. This guy right here. Welcome to Dead Man's Drink. Who's this guy? Huh. That's You're going suspicious. to have men around here wrapped around your finger. A strong drink will chase off that chill in the air. Finally, Mark Karth. Good old Arnleaf and Mark Karth. Well, what am 
I supposed to do? God. Never leave the house? No, no, no. We gave it the office. Did you see what happened? I'm so oh, I think you dropped this. You Some kind of note. Now, Looks important. Is that what we're going to teach I'd our daughter? Get going. Mama, Look why are you and Pop? Did you hear all that noise outside? It's just the market travel. We should get back to work. You there, if you're here. There we go. Mission accomplished. Speech up to 50. Trade, step up to the counter. Uh, don't mind if and I do. Customers. I just check the shipments. You need to leave. What? Is it? You need to leave. Hang on. Did I kind of like sneak in here? Off business hours? Oh, I did. Okay. <laughs> That's how good you are, Leia. Damn, you got your stealth on. Okay. Um, that's it. All that is required now is to get another perk point so we get the merchant perk. We got speech up to, to the required level of 50, but we need another perk point. Let's go jam out a whole bunch of uh, power potions again. Or just any kind of potions. Combat potions, whatever. Um... Stone, He's stone, that's correct. You there, step up to the counter. Come on, come on, come on. Don't make me vault. Come on, come on. Okay, that's it. This is the <laughs> If I can't get. Sure thing. It's you. I'll okay, get the you well rested room. bonus. Right this way. Remember. Have a nice, comfortable sleep on their granite bed. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Uh, I feel well rested. Don't mind the yelling. My pants are. Finally, up to the hag's cure to crank out some potions. Okay, what did I have in mind? Um, some dragon busting potions. Dragon's tongue, juniper. Bear, no, wait, not is it juniper? No, snowberries and thistle branch. Yeah, we can make thirty-seven of these. There we go. My dragon busting potion resist thirty percent fire and thirty percent frost. Perfect for taking on dragons. That's right. And how about some um, fortified marksman potions? Come on, 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 just short. Well, uh, one more skill book would do it. Any kind of skill book. You think it's a sell some cure is here for all you I have potions for disease, love sickness, irritating children. Oh, I know what I could do. Now you let me know if you need a cure or anything else. Convince that orc to leave the uh um um uh, I'll be able to pronounce his name as soon as I see him. Down here at the smelter. I'm on the way. You having some problems? He's a damn tyrant. Always being goaded by this. Yeah, yeah, okay. Next to nothing. We get okay. If we make a mistake. And what if we talk to him? You're gonna try to talk sense into that orc? Yep. Believe it. Watch this. Talking to people. You're not one of my workers. What are nope. you doing? You hard of hearing. I run. Look, I want you to leave that guy alone. What? Are you telling me how to treat my workers? Yes, we are. Do you have any idea how much metal the Silver Blood family wants us Don't to Don't matter. Sell? We are one smooth talking gal. All right. There all we right. go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, the boy. But I get it. I'm the way. We did it. Well, Give us the money. Believe it. Buy some. Me and Hathraso mostly. Great. There we go. <laughs> and finally, we got ourselves this perk point. What about hold up here? Swing it on over. Merchant. Mission accomplished. That is it. I want to thank you all very much for watching. Join me next time when we continue this transitional series of videos.
back in business. Thanks for watching. See you next video. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1. That's all. That's all it takes. All right. Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.